Hey, what is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joking John City Four, and today, people, we will continue the series Freeman Guerrilla Warfare. Hopefully, you guys have been enjoying the series. If you guys have, make sure you leave a comment to give me some feedback, or also leave a like. That would be an amazing thing to see my my little notifications. So, so far, so good, you know. And by the way, this is another recording session because the last time I played it was at 8 24 2019. So it's been quite a quite a long time. It's been like two weeks. So um, we're gonna continue the series, and hopefully it does go pretty well. You know, we are getting to take it over though, but I'm, I'm gonna be a little bit patient about it. I gotta recruit at least like 70. Just give me 70 minimum, 100 tops. You know, I can probably pull it off with those numbers. It's just that I need more people. So we're not going to sacrifice my whole unit just like this, how we are right now. You know, at 49, I don't think we can pull it off. We're going to need to, like, really, really recruit some serious, you know, members. And uh, hopefully it does go pretty well. So what we're going to do right now, we're going to grind a little bit. We're going to see how many wars we can get into, upgrade our units to their maximum level. Also, we're going to buy some stuff from the black market. And our first territory that we're probably going to be taking over will be all these three right here. All these three are terrorists territories Jobin was taken over uh the last episode right yeah we took it we took it over and then it got taken over by some other state that i don't even know who's it from to begin with so um so yeah a lot of cool things happened in the past few episodes let's go to the barracks let's see if we can buy some few people here we get to have like around forty-eight thousand in cash so we can hire some more Oh, Snow Fox Special Sniper. Uh, do you guys really want to know how long it took me to really take over a damn castle in Mountain Blade? It took me at least, like, more than, like, 16 hours. And so far, I think, like, we're, we're in hour 10 or less than that. I'm not sure how long it's been. Hey, cancel, cancel, cancel. We're about to skip the whole damn day. So, yeah, like, it takes a while, man. It really does. Let me check my party real quick. The Grass Wolves... The grass wolves are. Uh, why is my morale super low? <sighs> Don't tell me they want to be rewarded. Yeah. We want to create more teams, though. We are going to create a whole team full of snipers. So we just need to hire two snipers, and this team is ready to go with a bunch of snipers too. So uh, the snipers, which is the grass wolves, along with the minutemen, it'll be a good combo to keep ourselves uh, some distance from the enemy. So uh, that's what we're going to do right now. Let's hire those sniper guys. Maybe like two, yeah, like two more, right? We just need two more. Hire militia sniper, hire militia sniper. There you go. Front line. We are gonna create a, like a bunch of front line units. If we do reach like to 100 and we can actually deploy 100 units, I'll probably just create a bunch of front line units. And uh, that's gonna be like our, our, like our pawns pretty much. All right, so now we have 51, 51 soldiers. Let's go find some people to fight and level them up. Along the way, we'll be recruiting even more people. More people, the better. And also, we gotta, like, really... Food is in... Oh, we need some food. That's what's going on. I didn't even know. Just in case we meet another random officer somewhere. Then we might, uh... What's going on here? The convoy's being attacked by, uh... We'll help, it. We'll help him out. We'll help him out, man. It seems like they need, do need a lot of help. to help out that fleet attack it's only 12 so we're just gonna send two units more than likely we're just gonna send the goths um the minimen the grass wolves and the goths hook right what's with the little uh green crosses on them they're going to be straight ahead of us. Y'all see anything? Oh, shoot. Where are they at? I don't see them anywhere. Okay, now, now I see them. Now I see them. They're like a mile away. You know how you guys were mentioning like uh, how bad the bullet drop is? I think I read one of the comments, and it told me that the bullet drop is random, which might be true because I'm like literally 
aiming like right on perfect on them and it's still not showing any kind of bullet drop. So like I'm not sure what's going on with that. Oh nice. Just got like back to back shots there. Almost. Let's go get him. What? Well, weirdly, I'm getting all these shots cleared, though. It's looking pretty well. Where is he? Oh, nice, nice, nice. We ended up winning. Booyah. What do you have? Like some... Ooh, 55 armor. These are not bad, to be honest. Let's go take some ingredients. We're going to probably sell them back into the black market, so... Finn. Who is Finn? Why does he have a star? And why does he have a name? I know this guy, the armored escort guard, which is from the uh, from the female Valor army or whatever. This guy can actually be released. You see relationship with the Valkyrie female fighters? Increased to 67. So we have an ally going on. This guy, though. Let's imprison him. I think it might be interesting how much money that we're going to get for him. So, imprison him. I'm hoping I get like 50 grand or something. That would be amazing. 100 grand though. Well, even more than that. I, I forgot how much it was for like the highest I ever got. It was like 60 something, right? It was like super expensive. Let's go to Drobin. Let's go. Uh, hopefully they don't attack. If they try to lit Venice is under siege of the FCA guard grenaders and army soldiers. Where's Litvin? Man, I don't know where Litvin is, but damn. Let's go sell them to Drobin. Dude, we do send them to Joven. The problem with this is that uh, they might actually try to capture him back. 14, 14k? Oh my god. Whatever. Alright. Uh, talk to bartender. There's no one to like really talk to here. I thought I would find like some kind of officer, but there's nothing. Scorpion Assault. 44,000. Man, he better come in with free Kool-Aid. <laughs> so, uh, what, what else we get? We, sh we should get like another set of militia riflemen. We just need like three of them, right? Or, or four. Oh my god. Why is everybody injured here, man? What's going on? What's the situation there? Alright. We are spending quite a, lot, a good amount of money. Uh, let's go check around. Maybe we can find like a whole unit to take over. Um, oh, there we go. There we go. We got an, Oh yeah, we, we totally have a war there in the middle. Should be helping out these Oksana. No? Oh, she, you literally abandoned him? You literally abandoned that one guy, whoever it is? Who is this guy? Chernevkin Militia Patrol. Desert Marauders. Let's go help him out. Attack. So yeah, we're going to be patrolling this whole area. Seeing how much how much you can raise, how much money. And also, how many soldiers we can recruit. Like, oh, this is going to be a straight-up battle. Okay, you know what? Let's call in the Igor, the Volo. Uh, I'm not sure about the sweep. You know what? I should call in the sweep team and send them across to the, to the flank. Just so they can be flanked by the sweep team. Damn it. I need to learn how to control this damn map thingy. Alright, the sweep team. You guys. Go through the side. Go through the side. Down the road. To see if this works. Not so much like right here. And then just sweep. I think we already fought in this map before, so it's gonna be a straight ahead combat. Let's just hope we don't get hit, hit by rockets and Molotovs or whatever the hell they're gonna be throwing. What the hell? We actually shot one? Oh, you know what? You know what I'm starting to think? I think they might have actually fixed the bullet drop. Because you know how bad it was. Look at this. I actually just got three shots in a row. Four shots. Oh, man. They actually did fix the bullet drop. Yeah, it's coming out smooth. Oh, never mind. I just missed it there. I just jinxed myself. Look at how smooth it is, man. Now it's counting like it was an actual shot. Look at that. How it's supposed to be. I think they're worried about the sweep team. Trying to go through the back still. Come on, Minutemen. Should be taking over right there. It's a straight up fight. Look at this, dude. The bullet drop is actually working pretty well. You see how I'm keeping the cross on top of the head? Oh, my. Never mind. <laughs> I'm 
hoping I kill like two and one there. I think I shot the guy in front of him. They keep protecting this one guy. Are they good? Is it Gucci? Still one guy right there. Got a hit marker. I mean, I'm getting a lot of hit markers, but you know, I'm making some damage. I'm still getting an XP, which is good. It's pretty amazing. He's still alive. Booyah. No casualties, though, which is good. A lot of freaking AK-76s, AKMs. <laughs> Okay, so now, oh my god, you know what, the black market is like far away, isn't it? Where's the black market? Did they, did it move? I think the black market moved, I'm not sure where it is. <sighs> okay, so now we're up to 55. I'm not sure how we're going to do this, man. We gonna have to take over a whole city with just 55 troops, or oh, there's the black market. I think it only opens at certain times. I just saw it right now. Look at it, it's still up there. All right, mercenary camp. I mean, there is a mercenary camp also on this side. I'm not sure if they have cheaper guys here. I don't remember. The post now fire. They do have some few. But I'm not sure what they do. I mean, they do have marksmanship of eight and it costs seven thousand. We got federal infantry for twenty-seven k, FCA riflemen, FCA grenaders. I mean, I, I really want to get one some of these, um, you know, FCA grenaders. Let's get this one, armed escort guard. I'm hoping he's not that bad though. He does cost fourteen k. God damn it, we gotta get we gotta get more money, man. More money somehow. More money, more crimes, or something. I don't know. We gotta take. We gotta start attacking the Uman terrorists. Maybe they start giving up some of the officers, and uh, you know maybe we can like cause some trouble around here. There are so many of them right now. What's up? What's up? You talking to me? You looking at me? You looking to my side? Hold it right there. You will not pass us alive. I am more interested in your life than your money. These Uman terrorists, man. All of them are going down. <laughs> they are, man. We're in war against them, and we are gonna take them over the home territory. And God. Damn it, we did start under a freaking hill. This is not a good thing. We're going to have to call everybody up. All right, go to like maneuver around. I just don't want them all together. Because I've seen what happens when people shoot your grenades and all that crap. I mean, it's freaking... It's, it's a very bloodbath, man. It's a big-ass bloodbath. All right, let's go. All right, uh, 1050. We do have enough ammo to take out like half of the army. Or make some certain damage to them. We gotta be fast before they start taking up our spot. Shoot, dude, they are gonna take over this freaking hill. By the way it looks, they are gonna take over this hill. I don't see them anywhere. Oh, there they are. Shit, they are throwing grenades. They are throwing grenades. Fucking A, dude. They are throwing a bunch of grenades. That's what I was afraid of, man. These guys are like really equipped with these damn things. Just don't throw me a freaking grenade, man. I'll be so pissed if they do. <laughs> are they alive? There's still one more. Hello. Perfect. Oh man, we had living casualties. 
This might actually be dangerous. It really is. Uh, these AKM-74s are strong. They do have heavy Kevlar vests. We have a Desert Bandit. <laughs> we have a bunch of Umen terrorists. All right. I wonder if they do have officers, though. That's one thing that I'm really, um, really like jumping about. Like, do they have officers that we can take over or not? 